Hi students. So now we'll uh, go the further of the chapter four science. So now we learn living things reproduce. Living things reproduce. How the living thing reproduce? Because of the reproduce, the life is still now sustained in the earth. Right? How the living things reproduce? Right? You can see the all the living things. They are reproducing. How is reproducing? Right? Animals reproduce by giving birth to babies or by laying eggs. Any animals, dogs, tiger, elephants, they are giving birth to the babies. Their own babies. You can see, and some animals birds they are giving the uh, laying the eggs. By the eggs, the smalls that uh, their things are coming. They're hatching the eggs, right? By the reproduction of the things, it's possible. The human being, they have their own babies. Tiger have their own baby. Elephant have their own baby, right? So all the living things that are reproducing the things, their own babies. Plants, small small plants are there, right? So animals reproduce by giving birth to babies or by laying eggs from their babies hatch. Then plants reproduce by producing seeds or spores. If you have the seeds used to, you know, put on the soil, so the plant will come, right? How used to plant the trees by the seeds, right or wrong? Then some plants, some plants coming by the coming by the seeds, but some plants grow from stems, sorry, stems. Stems, roots, or leaves. Some plants come from the stems, roots, or leaves, or leaves. Right? After that, whatever we have gone through the all the characteristics of the all things, whatever the all things, living thing, non-living things. Right? What the characteristics to properly identify? Scientists have divided. All things, right? To identify the all the things. So how they divide it? So look at here. The all the characters, all living things, all things, all things they divide into two parts: living things, non-living things. Living things one, non-living things one. Right? Divide into two parts. Plus, when the living things are talking about either plants or animals, either plants or animals. Right? They are the what? Non-living things. They are the non-living. Sorry, they are the living things. Either the plants or animals. Then non-living things. Non-living things means either it can be the fan, it can be the watch, it can be the blackboard, it can be the mobile. All these things are the non-living things. All these things are non-living things. Again, I am telling you. Scientists divided in the two parts all the things, either in the living things or non-living things. Either living things or non-living things. Living things it can be plants or animals. Living things it can be plants or animals, and non-living things who don't have the life, like brain, legs, right? Car, truck, bus, mobile, watch, bags, fan, blackboards, all are the What all are the non-living things? Books, all the things are. So this is the conclusion of your chapter four, living things, right? So you must have to do the exercise or the short question properly. Just go through the question answer properly. Just go through the video carefully. Then we can do the short question answers, right? Thank you so much.